Welcome back, everybody. A special group of friends have been leading midnight missions to help our nation's homeless veterans get back on their feet. And now this program could be coming to a city near you. Anna Coyman has more on the GI Go Fund. Anna? Hey there, Uma. Well, the GI Go Fund is a charitable group started by two patriotic brothers and a friend who lost a high school buddy while serving in Iraq. The tragedy inspired them to give back, and now volunteers walk city streets helping homeless veterans get back on their feet. I was 19. I'm 66 now. And homeless for almost a decade. Gene Anderson served on a gunship during the Vietnam War, but couldn't find a job when he returned. I was honored, and when I was in the service, I had a lot of respect. When I came home, people turned their backs on me because I was in Vietnam. It's homeless vets like Anderson, the GI Go Fund, is helping with their midnight missions. My goal is to make sure that we're getting them off the streets, finding them housing, and helping them connect them to a front door key in their pocket. Uh, before they die. Volunteers offer a bag of food and clothing to anyone in need. If they're a vet, information about veterans affairs, housing and jobs programs is given, as well as health care. Numbers are hard to gauge, but according to the U.S. Department of Housing and Urban Development, in the year 2011, on any given night, 67,495 veterans were homeless on the streets. Veterans account for 14 percent of the entire U.S. adult homeless population. Vets are vulnerable because of the inability to find jobs, home foreclosures, and many dealing with post-traumatic stress disorder. Most all my people have died and gone in different directions, so I'm pretty much a loner. Our obligation back here at home is to protect their families while they're deployed and to take care of them when they come back home. Hats off to this group. Each night, volunteers give out dozens of supplies bags. The GI Go Fund has plans in the works currently to expand their midnight missions to Baltimore, Philadelphia, and Washington, D.C. Uma, back to you. It's a great effort and an inspiring program indeed. Anna, thank you very much. Mm -hmm. We 